Claire Barnes, age 29. She's about to discover what kinds of horrors lurk in the darkness of a deserted road. Do I press a button? Radio's getting all messed up. Do I press a button? Oh, okay, I click. A flat, a flat tire. Delay, is that how you spell t Is this a British game? A flat tire delayed Claire's trip. Little she suspects how this little incident will change her life forever, as well as her perspective on reality. Do I, do I tune the radio? Oh, I just turn it off. Okay. Tonight's episode, The Highway. She just shrugged. An unexpected obstacle, a new delay for Claire. She might need to find some help to resume her journey as soon as possible. Fortunately, she notices a signal pointing to a near emergency emergency phone. Let's wish her luck. Oh, right there. So, oh, okay, so it's a point and click. I thought it, I was gonna have to control it weird. So that boy's all scribbled out for some reason. Someone does not like him. And I'm pretty sure that's a missing poster. Ooh. This could have been bad. Because we stopped right here and then we just, like, walked over it. If, like, one of those power lines were a little bit... Or the water was just a little bit closer, she could have got electrocuted. Anyway, welcome to Midnight Scenes. This is indie horror game I found on Itch.io. It's... The first of, um, oh, I was trying to go down here, of many, hopefully, because they're trying to make more games like this, is like a Twilight Zone sort of feel to it. I want to look at this first. Or not. That's the same kid, but this one's not, like, scribbled on. That one's torn. Someone does not like this kid. Yeah, that one looks like maybe normal wear and tear. Definitely the first one. These two might be just like normal, like from just being outside. Oh! Okay then. So now we know why the pole's down. Oh, that's not the spec. I thought that was a sign. Uh, is there anyone in there? A photo. That's the boy. With a flower. And a werewolf. No, that's the dad. A horse. Nice happy family. Would that actually hold them? Because I feel like it wouldn't, but. Okay, what's this? String. Can we use the string on this? No, didn't think so. Is there anything? Ooh. A hammer? Yeah, a hammer. Cool. What's this? A complicated scarecrow. Alright. There's... Huh. Okay. There's oil everywhere. Leading up to the scarecrow, too. Hey. Oh. So you can move his arm. But he's missing an arm. Is this his arm? Well, mystery solved. Found his arm. Here you go. 
Can we move? Oh, it just falls off. Uh, string it. Oh, there we go. Is that all about it? Well, I did it. Figured out the puzzle. Didn't know it was a puzzle. I just knew you could move his... Oh, okay, so, like, the arrow's showing that his arms have to be up in the air to open this complicated little gate. Is there anything else out here? Nope. Okay, let's go in. Ooh, this house looks like it was... Like it's haunted. There's a little bit of screen tearing, and I'm sorry for that. Actually... It only seems to be doing it on... My screen for some reason. Hopefully it looks fine in the recording. I can't really tell. This looks like the, um... American Gothic. I think that painting's called... I'm not really sure, though. Can we look at all of them? Can we look at this one? Oh, it's the baby! Okay, so we can look at the TV. Okay, that's just... That's him and his truck. He really liked his truck, but now it crashed. Oh, is that... Is that a foot? Was that oil or blood? I, I just thought it was oil. I'm gonna look at all the pictures. There's him, setting up his... Complicated scarecrow. Um... Don't want to go in there yet, so let's look around. Treehouse, but we can't get up there. <laughs> she reaches, that's adorable. Let's grab this. We have a little hammer, so maybe we can. Oh. <laughs> I love that. This falls down. Okay, what's this? A horseshoe. So this is like a grave for the horse. I don't know if they had a dog or anything and the horse ain't around. Poor little horse. And I just took its thingy. Ooh. So it seems like a small pu Let's go inside and look at the bathroom real quick. Before... Oh, it's not... Oh. I was like, it's not blinking anymore. Well, the lights broke. There's obviously no dead body in there, right? How do we leave? There we go. Okay, so we gotta get up in the treehouse for some reason. We just kind of crashed. Why are we doing this? Uh, combine these? Yeah. There we go. Oh, she uses the hammer automatically. Cool. Now when the tree... Oh. It treehouse is destroyed. What's this? A lantern? Oh. Okay, so... A lantern works so we can see into the bathroom. Yeah, the treehouse looked like it got struck by lightning or something, or it was, like, on fire. Do we just walk in? It's like, oh my god. Excuse me, sir. Are, are you okay? Ooh, what is that? It's like, oh, there was a key around his neck. I did not see that oh that's his overalls i was like what's sticking out of his head is that like a crowbar no nope, but it's, it's just his strap to his overalls okay then what happened to him he was trying to bandage up at the sink and it looks like he fell over and just dead okay bye sir don't want to bother you keep doing what you're doing being dead and all can we go? No, we can't go that way. Um, keys for this, right? Yep. Now we got this. We don't need anything else, apparently. What do we need clippers for? I don't think there was anything else in the house. So let's go back. 
Maybe there's something this way. Nope, nothing. Do we cut the wire? We do cut the wire. I thought that would be like... I thought she would like get electrocuted or something. Can we walk past it now? Yeah, we can go to the phone. Cool. Oh. 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 Oh no. What happened? I thought, okay. This is like the whole thing. There's a person. And a map. What's this? Oh, that's, that's the pause menu. Don't know why I didn't notice that before. Oh, there's options. Should probably check that out beforehand, but never mind. So that the little map for some reason that we couldn't take. And then there's a person. Are they dressed in lab coats? She looks like she's in a bonnet. What? But. Like, clipboards and stuff. What about this guy? Go back to this guy. Is he wearing a lab coat? I, I can't tell. I don't know why I thought it would, like, zoom in on him. Yeah, but it looks like she's wearing a bonnet. Not a lab coat. Oh, is that the boy? Is that who was circled in the other one? Good thing they all conveniently, conveniently have these clipboards with pictures on them tell me what's going on so was the kid getting um experimented on and then he like escaped and he did this nine 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 do, do I grab the phone it's offline okay yeah so we can't use it do we go forward into the cave oh hi Hello? Are you okay? Oh good, he ran away. We're not dead. Oh, he dropped something. Oh, Yeah, that was him. He loved his horse. Why? Claire Barnes, age 29. With great effort, she finally managed to push aside the fallen power pole and rescue her and resume her journey. Whoa, she's strong. Still terrified, she stopped in the first gas station to contact the authorities and inform about the disturbing events she had just witnessed. Nothing out of the ordinary was found by the police on the stretch of road. No signs of any crash or presence of any mysterious kid. The man living in the farm was found a bit drunk, but in good condition. What? Not a single word was written in any newspaper about the horrors Claire witnessed that night. She went on with her life, trying to con convince herself that she wasn't crazy after all. That she probably just saw something not meant to be seen. Midnight Scenes. The Highway. That was shorter than I thought it'd be. Design Programming Arts and Music by Octave Navarro. Sound effects, freesounds.org. Cool. And Pixel Font by Sumpix. And made with Unity. So that was a fun game. Definitely could see the inspiration from, like, Twilight Zone and stuff. If you enjoyed this short game, please consider supporting my work on Patreon. If you like the game, guys... Consider visiting their Patreon. I'm looking forward to more of their games. Like, with the same style and stuff. It was short, but it, like, put its point across. That she witnessed this, and it wasn't really there. But it was? Ow. Ow. I hit my elbow. So, I wonder why they didn't find anything. Because that guy was definitely dead. And so was everyone else. Maybe 
maybe the kid, like, got back. Because he had, like, he obviously had some, like, psychic powers or something. And he, like, made everything back to normal. And he didn't attack us or anything because we obviously didn't know him or do anything to him. So he just let us go. But he, like, made everything back to normal. And I don't know. I, I don't know. I'm trying to explain this. Anyway, if you like the video, consider giving it a like. Or considering hitting the like button, comment below, subscribing if you would. And I hope to see you in the next video. Bye bye I need to find... Okay, so what happens if I click? Do I just exit? Why is it still recording? I pressed the button. I pressed the button.